Every five years, national demographic and health surveys conducted in Nigeria to provide up-to-date estimates on basic demographic and health indicators. And this is the sixth to be conducted since 1990, and the reports have been helping key players in the health sector to plan. Rafi Hamid reports after the president launched the 2018 report, each state is expected to make the report available to stakeholders to ensure effective planning. Joe State has 876 primary health care centers, nine state specialist hospitals, five general hospitals, and 37 comprehensive health centers. Recently, the state government approved the contract for the renovation of 332 PHCs, while the state specialist hospital, Ashibiaru, is also being upgraded. But this is far from enough for a population which is about 4 million people as residents seek access to good and quality healthcare service regardless their status. At the launch of the 2018 Demographic Health Survey held in Oshogo, Governor Boyegawi Tola is hopeful that the report will strengthen health sector in the state. The presentation of this 2018 NDHS report, which we are launching today, will be studied critically to know the performance of the state of Oshun in the health education, and other sectors covered by the report with a view to knowing the good, the bad, and the ugly areas of which efforts must be harnessed for improvement and better performance for the good of the state. But we are doing everything humanly possible to address those challenges. Where we haven't been really well, we need to improve on that. Even the areas where we have, we appear to be doing well, we still not, we do not need to rest on our hours. We need to keep pushing so that we do not go back. The Federal Commissioner, National Population Commission, Mudashiru Uzin, says new approaches were introduced to conduct the 2018 National Demographic Health Survey. The anthropometry processes was improved to collect high quality health and weight measurement from children and women. A new biometric checklist was introduced to ensure that no important tasks were missed. The survey is designed to provide data for monitoring the population and health situation of Nigeria. The report provides reliable estimates of demographic and health indicators, including family planning methods, breastfeeding practices, maternal and child health, domestic violence, female genital mutilation, malaria, among others. Rafiu Hamid. TVC News, Ushubu.